How many guys you got coming back on both sides of the We got five on each. Um, so most of those would be seniors who, who played last year, but uh, then we got a number of kids who got some significant playing time. We weren't necessarily starters, but got in um, minutes. And obviously 18 solid seniors. Uh, this is one of the largest classes we've had in probably four or five years. And so uh, we're all excited about them. They've had success in the past from junior high all the way through. Um, and so we're, we're excited about them. They've had a good summer. Um, it's a good good group of kids who uh, are good kids, uh, good character kids, and uh, have you know played football with each other for a very long time. So uh, we're excited about that to see what they can do as seniors and what their leadership will be like and how they can take the underclassmen with them. I think our receiving core is, is a strength. We've got several kids back and Cameron Livingston, uh, who was hurt most of last year, but um, he, you know, he was a starter as a sophomore. We got a new kid, um, a sophomore coming in we really like named Ryland Crawford, uh, but another senior named Grayson LaRock who's just done an outstanding job in the offseason and, and uh, you know building his body up and he looks really good as well. So some experience at receiver. Paint McHale's another one. Uh, Owen Lance, those guys all got a lot of time at the receiver position last year. And then uh, Peyton Wall, um, really our offense will kind of run around Peyton. Um, he played receiver last year, kind of moved him to tailback. He'll start the season at tailback and um, probably probably stick most of the year running the ball. So, um, you know, those are those are some seniors right there that we're excited about and who have played a lot. I think our conference is really competitive. I mean, really competitive um, as it is every year. But, you know, I think we've got, you know, obviously you've got New Haven, East Noble, who are always strong. Um, and then, uh, you know, DeKalb, I think, is, is a team that will really be good this year. Uh, in our conference, and you know, Columbia City is still uh, is building, um, you know, and, and I think they finished strong last year as well. So I think it's you know top to bottom really competitive conference.